home about it. I was driving for a living, working at Nightline Taxi, Taxi, riding with the rhythms of this wealthy, sleazy city, bounding up the avenues, trying to make the lights. Nice piece of driving, said a passenger one night. And they're looking for me everywhere, with money in their pockets and their hands in the air. In the corner of my eye, the corner of the street, the corner of the screen. The window is like a screen, the windshield, I mean. That's what they call it in England, you know, a windscreen. Of course, there's no wind in here. Fleet caps don't have AC. The streams of storefronts scrolling by on left and right. Traffic in the side streets like alien craft that are poised to attack. The roadway is a treadmill disappearing beneath us and there's not really much of a sky, just gray or black. Numbers on the street signs count out like a referee. Which neighborhood you, you're into and out of. Your coolness quotient, your chic mystique. The walk lights are flashing, I'm speeding up for yellow as I notice cautious walkers stepping gingerly off the curb and I wonder just how high they bounce if I suddenly jerk the wheel and swerve. <laughs> but you know, piss and vinegar and coffee and adrenaline don't always get you through the shift. And this was the 1980s, the Reagan Revolution. The traders on the stock exchange were sniffing lines of cocaine. But that's no good for driving. I was more like those fighter pilots in the big world war. They had their bennies. We had black beauties. It's a matter of life and limb. But as an independent contractor, I was an entrepreneur. Hey, look at me. Filing Schedule C. You know there's a familiar kind of pavement that you'd see all over town? The black top asphalt patched up temporary forever kind? All lumpy with rounded bumps with metal things protruding? Steel plates and storm drains? Manhole covers with steam escaping? It looks like skin with bandages and scabs. And it becomes my skin. I see it in my sleepless bed. There's like red and itchy swellings that break open and reveal structures being pushed out like a veteran's old shrapnel. Miniature versions of the metal and the pavement soup and those grapes and the sidewalks that cover the vents for the subway tunnels. Hard rectangular rigid grids all lined up in a row like cars of a train. I start to see them on the back of my hand, tattooed over the paths of my veins. They say some jobs are in your blood. I think this one's in my flesh. Another cabbie told me, that's how Elvis Presley they first got started on drugs, you know. They gave him speed in the army. Pull over, near a graze papaya somewhere. Step away from the taxi cab. The city will still be there. <laughs>